Oh yeah! <laughs> these headphones from five below by the way i know some people might think it's funny but uh i am glad that i found a pair of headphones that isn't so bad you know they were cheap and i don't ever use this i don't use this i just like turning it on because i like the way the light looks i just like the way that looks when i have it like this but it, the microphone's actually like the microphone's right here. <laughs> yes, it's a snowball. And yes, I didn't realize how loud the fan would be. I try to use noise reduction technology on it, so hopefully that helps some. I will remember to turn the fan off the next time I record. Deep breath. The problem is, I had already recorded two more videos after this one before I noticed the fan was blowing directly into the back of the mic. So you're gonna hear the whooshing sounds for two more gameplays. Sorry. Look, I'm sorry, but I don't have money like that, so... This is my nephew's Paddington, and I have... I have, um emotional support one and two and then i have my nieces i have my nieces midoria and then i have my nephews paddington yeah so okay so this is assessment examination i think uh i'm just gonna go into it full screen i'll just say no because i tried to record it in full screen right now and it wasn't working assessment examination start okay the examination will now begin Hello, friend. Thanks Hello. for applying for this position at the Authenticity Assessment Department. All of us here at <laughs> are very happy to have you. If you get the job, that is. Today, we'll be testing your instincts to see if you're qualified to perform authenticity assessments on your own in a real-life scenario. But before that, some quick questions are required to get some more insight about who we would be hiring. Okay. Please take a sit and await further instructions. How did you hear about this position? Word of mouth? How about newspaper since I, it was on Google? Do you have any professional experience in this area? No, actually. Do you have any personal experience in this area? Yeah, actually. Do you believe in God? Um, yeah. Of course, uh, not everybody does, and that's 100% okay. You don't have to believe, and you don't have to not believe, and you could be in the middle where you either are undecided, or you're like, there's no evidence to say one way or the other. You can believe whatever you want. Me, personally, I believe that there is a God. I used to be angry at him because of the stuff I've been through, so... Uh, I'm scared something's gonna jump out at me if I take too long, but I used to be angry at him back in 2010 and I was I, I had turned into an atheist out of spite But um, you know because I was like you had the power to stop all this stuff that have been that has happened from happening You just didn't that's the way I saw it and it, it's all complicated and it'll take explaining explaining uh, all of that and all all of all of my thoughts that that would make take a whole separate video but you know in short yes i do believe there's a god yes do you fear death uh no sometimes i covet death like, i've tried to end my life several times uh i talked about it here i talked about it here on this channel and i have songs on my on my music channel why is strands of hair in my lap Okay, anyways. No, I don't fear death. I fear it only for people. Do you fear God? Uh, out of respect? Yes. Do you have people you love in your life? Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Do you fear losing them? 100%. That's the part... The hell is that? That's the part of death that I fear is losing them you know and yes i know it sounds weird because i have tried to uh end myself and so uh i guess some people that don't understand they'll be like well don't you think they're scared of losing you you're selfish it's, it's not that we don't it's not that our art when you're in so much pain you can't think of all that stuff you're just like end the pain anyway 
I can't. You know, that's what pops into your head. But, um, so yeah. I'm scared of them losing me. I'm scared of my mom and my dad losing me. Uh, I'm 100% scared of losing them, yes. In a moment, we will provide you with several images of people and you must determine whether or not these people are authentic and to be trusted or threats you should stay away from. Okay. Please be careful with your selections. Our decision on whether to hire you will depend heavily on your results. Oh boy, I don't like faces. True or threat? I mean, his eye could- he could have just been born like that. I could trust him. Oh god. No! No! That's a threat! I don't like this. Okay. Mm, yeah, she could be trusted. I'm scared. He's, he looks regular. I don't like this. Oh, whoa. What is that? I don't know what that was. Okay. Mm, he looks, like, trustworthy. Her eyes are black. Nah, something's wrong with that picture. Okay. Oh! Wait, he kind of looks like... He kind of looks like a little tiny bit like R. Kelly. That should not be true. I'm just gonna push dress because he looks... Right, oh. Nah, no, 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 sir. I'm scared. Diazepam? Five milligram tablet? Take five tablets by mouth nightly? Diazepam. Hey, I used to be on that medicine, or I am now. The medicines have different... They have different names. Oh, jeez. Oh. You look like that dude from, um, In Living Single. Yeah, you look okay. Okay. Wait. Mm -mm. I don't know. I don't like that picture. Something's wrong there. Okay, she's trustworthy. Okay. Francisco Estrada, 19, victim 2. Miss Department, what's your emergency? Yeah, hi. I'm at Door Park at a gas station, actually in the corner of Door Park. Dooring? Dooring Park. I think there's somebody here who needs help. There's a kid outside. He's got some blood on him. Is he hurt? I don't know. He looks fine. It's just he's outside and the door is locked, so I can't tell. He is asking for help though, so I don't know if you can hear, but he's asking me to help him. Okay, I'm dispatching an ambulance right now. Is there any way you can unlock the door? Oh, I can unlock it for sure. I work here. I have the keys. Then what's stopping you? Well, I mean, I wanted to help him, obviously, the moment he came in. It's a kid with blood on him, for Christ's sake. But, and this is gonna sound like crazy to you. Just as I was pulling out my keys, I saw it. His face, his face, you know? He had this look. It reminded me of something. I don't know what something I'm terrified of. I don't know, man. But something's off about this kid. Like, real off. You're going to let this kid bleed out because he feels off? No, that's not what I'm saying. He's... he's not dying, I don't think. He just doesn't look right as all. Can't look like he had died himself. But he hasn't, obviously. He looks like a ghost. Or a demon. It's hard to explain. Maybe I'm just right now. I've been drinking a little bit, but you had to see him. It's scary shit, officer. Oh god, I'm scared. Officer? Uh-uh! No! He must be... Mm -mm. What the f***? He must... He must be pale because... Of... He must be pale because of blood loss. 
poor kid can't even keep his eyes straight and not because he drank two, um, one too many cheap beers. Is he still there? How does he look? Uh, yeah, he's... I don't know. I'm like crouching under the counter so I can't even see what's going, what he's doing. It's creepy. Oh, Lord. <clears throat> okay, well, the ambulance is still a good 20 minutes away, and that kid cannot be doing well. So, I need you to go assist him. Oh, that. No way, no. You don't see that little He's not normal. You know, refusal to, you know refusal to cooperate is a crime, right, son? Is it, though? Like, if you feel like you're in danger, this is kind of like that scenario where it's like three, three or four in the morning, and a little girl knocks on your door, and she's like, help, help, someone's coming at me, you have to let me in, and it's like, you want to help her, but you could open that door, and people that are with her will rush you, and you don't know what's going to happen. So it's like, it's that kind of situation? It, so, I don't know. Yes, I have my hand because I'm, I'm a little b Is... I'm joking, I, I do get to... Is, is that what that is? Of course. F okay, I'll go check on him then. Thank you, I'll stay on the line. Alright. Ave Maria Santissima... Sa Ave Maria... Santissima? Santissima? Oh, what the f Hell no! If that's that little boy... I don't trust that either! I don't trust that. Mm -mm. Excellent. You have now completed the authenticity assessment examination. Congratulations. Okay. If you are accepted in the you will receive a letter on <laughs> And while you're out here, why not come over to Dory Park? Admire the tall and beautiful trees all around, or watch as some of our little ones grow. Bring the kids along, they'll have a fantastic the time along. in our new play area. There is truly no better place to make beautiful memories. Dore Park, one of the county's most lovely locations. Alright. Staring on the keyboard down here, because... I don't know what's happening. No! I can see his pain. I see it from my window. I see it every night. I can hear his steps. I hear them from my window. I hear them every night. Father of many, his tears taste like sacrifice. His steps carry guilt? Why haunt this one park? Why torment my dreams nightly? Does he fear Does he fear nightmares? I do. Every dream I ever, ever had has been a nightmare, so... I'm on medication for it, but it doesn't seem to help very much. I can see his pain. I see it from my window. I can see it's fake. But... I won't sleep tonight. Won't listen to the man's steps. Or I will be next. Okay. Excellent. You have now completed the authenticity assessment examination. Congratulations. If you are accepted in the you will receive a letter on April the 23rd at 10.04 a.m. If the letter arrives before that, stay inside, lock your doors and windows and wait for the real letter to arrive. Do not call the police. If the real letter does not arrive and you believe in a god, pray to them. If they are real, hope they will take pity on your soul. If everything goes well, However, we'll see you very soon. Our Father who art in heaven, help me that you let the love of on and earth as it is in heaven, gives us dear daily bread, because our trust we will give us trust for us, and lead us not to temptation, but deliver from all sin, evil, for that is the kingdom, the power, the glory, forever and ever, in Jesus' name, amen.
Nah, end that. <laughs> Nothing jump scared me. I thought something was gonna jump scare me the whole time. Okay, so uh, 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 uh